And wait, and now we're back with an actual reaction video. We have not done the winery dogs in one whole year. Yeah, but they haven't even made music. I oh, do have two albums of Get things we can do. They have a new album coming out in March. We're going on tour. We gotta go. The winery dogs. Anyway, this is their new song. Is Zandu? Zanadu? I don't know. No idea. But are you ready? Ready. All right. <laughs> Always wearing the same thing. Similar thing, I mean. Wow. already uh, already a lot happening all right well we got um we got some nice guitar licks by your boy richie cotton <laughs> that little bass note at the beginning was really cool um his voice is always impeccable we haven't done a richie cotton ish song in a i while. always forget how good these yeah. guys are and this is considered a super group because they're all from other bands and you can tell like they're so tightly knit and sounds great together. Mm hmm. Great stuff so far. No, 
I can't be over. Oh, it's over. Well. Holy smokes. That's a return if I've ever seen one. He just has a way of, like, melting people's clothes off. Like, did you not feel like... <laughs> Like a I connection a between, yeah, yeah, between you two. Like every time he's yeah. on the camera, I'm like oh. staring into you. Yeah. And he also just keeps improving, and improving on the guitar every time he releases something new. It seems. So good point. Where are all three of these guys from? Well, you know Richie Cotton. Most he was a solo artist. Joined Poison, got famous, then went to Mr. Big, and and now. He's doing his solo stuff again and Wenry Dog. I'm not sure about the other two. Where are the other two from? The bassist is from Mr. Big. And then you don't you know Mike Portnoy from Dream Theater? Oh. Yeah, he's from Dream Theater. Oh my god. Yeah, you know him. Shit, it's like the all all yeah. stars. Okay, I didn't realize that. And so. uh, no. Oh so. Dog. Anyways. What I really love about Mike Portnoy is, despite how technically skilled he is, he has a really good feel for every single artist or song he's in. So he doesn't have to go overboard. It just, like, it, the drumming just fits perfectly, you know? For real. And then, um, I really liked how the chorus evolved every time they did it. Like, they start, they kept adding more, yeah. more stuff to it, so, yeah. The solos are great, the little licks are great, Richie Kotzen never lets us down. Never lets us down. I'd like to ask the viewers, who are your top ten bass guitarists? Top ten bass guitarists, that's From a good that, one. From that, I think we should do a reaction video, so hit it up in the comments, subscribe. Yep, yeah, do all that, and yeah, bass guitarist one is a great question that we haven't asked yet. So. We haven't asked it. So. Also, let them know about our Skid Row giveaway. We do have a Skid Row vinyl giveaway. It ends on December 18th, so if you want to be part of that, go check out that video. It's on our channel. I'll link it in the description. Other than that, we will see you in the next video.